Nearly half a million people in the US and in Europe are diagnosed with lung cancer every year. Innovata is a clinical cancer genomics company transforming cancer care. We're able to do this with a liquid biopsy, a simple blood draw that's able to track how cancer is responding to treatment. I had really a nice life. I never thought at the time that I would be sick. The only thing that I had that was a bit strange is my coughing. The first doctor I consulted told me I had sinusitis. Then I was told that I had gastric reflux. Then I was diagnosed with asthma. One day, while I was sleeping, I had a very strange dream. I had something within my chest. And this thing within my chest was growing and was preventing me from breathing. The next morning, and the first thing I did was to consult a lung specialist. The doctor told me, you've got a mass in your lung. It's a question of months or maybe weeks. You should write your will. Many patients with these advanced cancers unfortunately don't have too long to live. So delays of weeks or months in terms of getting people to the right therapy can really impact not just the amount of, of life they have left, but the quality of the life during that time. Today, many patients rely on tissue biopsies to be able to guide their therapy. But we know that in patients with widespread disease where there may be multiple different pieces of cancer across the body, taking one piece of tissue is not going to give you a whole picture of what's going on. And that's where techniques like liquid biopsy, where you actually get to survey the whole of the patient's cancer, can provide a real additional benefit. Ultimately, the physician's ability to help a patient comes down to what information do they have at their fingertips about that patient's disease. That information is readily accessible at the genomic level in the patient's blood. At Innovata, we've developed a liquid biopsy that from a simple blood draw actually allows the clinician to gain insights into what's happening at the tumor level. This knowledge empowers clinicians to understand their patient's cancer and guide which treatments they should pursue. And so the first thing that we did was a, a solid biopsy. Unfortunately, the solid biopsy was inconclusive. So we were in a therapeutic situation where we didn't know what to do. My oncologist recommended that we do a liquid biopsy with a laboratory situated in Cambridge. One of the most interesting stories at in Innovata has to do with the very first patient we ever tested. And what drove it was a clinician in a cafe in Paris, France at a conference, looking across the table at myself and our chief scientific officer, Nitzen Rosenfeld, and literally saying, when are you going to test my patient? And I trust in your results. I trust and believe in your assay. When can you test my patient? And it really was a call to action for our team. That very first patient had an actionable mutation. The patient was treated, responded beautifully to that treatment. In fact, the patient has personally told me, I wouldn't be here today if it hadn't been for your test result. This test, in fact, triggered a change in therapy, which gave me almost 18 months of progression-free survival until my cancer was mutated again. Of the several thousand patients that we've tested to date and the samples that we've analyzed over time from these patients, what we see is an even bigger opportunity to impact their care by monitoring them over time. That's where the company's really headed. We can tell whether patients are getting better or worse on treatment, so we can give reassurance that patients are on the right therapy if that's the case or give confidence to be able to switch therapies to, to other ones if patients aren't responding. On my side, I've always thought that knowing 
was helping me to survive and helps me to build trust. If there is no trust, there is no survival because you need to believe in the treatment you receive to fight for it. The liquid biopsies give me visibility. We're not guessing anymore and we can make an informed decision. Now that we have the tools to elucidate what's happening at the tumor level from blood, combined with this breadth of therapeutic availability, I think it really offers a hope that we can truly transform cancer care into a more manageable disease and give that patient the best shot at survival. Mm -hmm.